but I need to get the windscreen in because the other side, the um, this little box, uh, whereas normally you wouldn't have any, you know, you wouldn't have your washer pipe out or anything like that to put that back in, uh, will restrict access or deny me access to run the washer pipe that comes from the back to the front. So now we've got to stick the screen in. So um, let's see how much of a headache that turns out to be. My mate Brian. Hello Brian. Hello Phil. Right. Back again for the donkey work. Bolt lid's still loose. This is why I've left it loose so we can get this screen back in and up. There is a seal up there. There is a seal up there which we haven't got. Do you want me to come around? Yeah, it's alright. Yeah. Okay. Go on. There's a seal up the top but um, it'll be okay. You better put the top in first, Brian. Roughly where it's supposed to go. Then, well, it needs to come to, uh, come to me a bit. Basically, I'm going to put a hammer and a chisel in there, and I'm just going to knock that. Only a, it's a couple of millimetres, that's all, if that, and that should make that come down, and um, then we can get the bulks back in, and um, that's it. That wasn't hard at all. And what I'll do is I'll use a lever to pop to just make a gap up the top so we can run some sealant in all the way around, and um, then re it. That was too easy. Understand it well, easy right? Okay, so now I've done that, I knock that over and I'll go and get the um, hinges bolted in. And it's starting to look like a lamb over again. 